Police in Greenfield are searching for answers tonight after finding a 26-year-old man apparently stabbed to death in a house. RTV6 reporter Chance Walzer has been following this investigation all day. He has more now on what investigators know right now. On December 23, 2012, at 6.49 a.m. this morning, officers of the Greenfield Police Department were dispatched. When they arrived in this quiet neighborhood, they discovered something not often seen here. A white man apparently stabbed to death. The subsequent investigation revealed two others, a 26-year-old man and a 27-year-old woman, were likely in this home as well. Police located them away from the scene, also with what appear to be stab wounds. Hillary Poplin lives just a few houses away. A little scary, um, just because it's so close. Uh, it just, I've never encountered something like that or been even near something that happened like that. Poplin says this is a safe neighborhood, quiet, with very little criminal activity. Today, crime tape and police cars are on display contrary to that perception. Investigators are searching the home and processing evidence, but are releasing very little information about what they think could have happened on the other side of these windows that led to the stabbing of three people. Police do say the public is safe and that they have located everyone possibly involved here. As of this evening, no arrests have been made and no charges have been filed. The officers of the Greenfield Police Department are working closely with the Hancock County Prosecutor's Office as well as the Hancock County Coroner's Office in the investigation of this death. This is an ongoing investigation. We are asking the public at this time, if you have any information, to please contact the Greenfield Police Department. Now, within the last hour, RTV6 has confirmed the identity of the man who died, 26-year-old Stephen Rogers of Greenfield. The two others with stab wounds were treated at area hospitals.